Hi, I'm Drew Van Acker. And I'm Tyler Blackburn. And <laughs> you are Just you. <laughs> watching. <laughs> I am Tyler Blackburn. I am Drew Van Acker. And, and you're, you're watching, watching THR.com. That was perfect. That was good. That was perfect. We were, yeah, very, we were in sync on that one. Yeah, we were. <laughs> I know that my dad risked a lot to protect you. I just don't know why. Was there something that happened between our families? Just talk to your dad when he gets back in town. You find out Spencer and Jason are actually related. I was shocked. Yeah, I was. Uh, I was very shocked because, because like Tyler said earlier, that you know it, it's not in uh, in the in the books and it's not it's not planned that way. And they kind of switched a couple things around to, to make that work. But. Um, mm -hmm. I was very shocked, but kind of relieved at the same time. I thought it was a different storyline, something that could be fun to kind of explore and yeah. navigate through. So, What does that mean for Spencer and, and Jason now? Um, I mean, it means a lot, actually, because their relationship wasn't, uh, wasn't exactly the best, um, you know, coming up to this point. Um, she always saw him as just this creepy older brother <laughs> slash neighbor, you know? Um, and now it's, things have just kind of taken a turn in a completely opposite direction and now Spencer and Jason are kind of forced to get along, cope, uh, you know, and not only cope, but try and make that relationship into what it should be. Um, what if we find out like we're related or something like that? <laughs> that would be pretty dope. Yeah. And then I'm related to Spencer. It's like everybody's just related in some way. That would be fun, yeah. but not. Weird at the same time, yeah. I guess. <laughs> whole, whole new show. Definitely a new kind of family. Rivers. I got a court order here to impound your laptop. What for? Someone's been hacking into secure school files. I traced them back to your IP address. Do you think if I did something like that, I'd be stupid enough to leave a trail? We'll find out. Come on, hand it over. As we all know, Caleb is a computer whiz hacker extraordinaire, so that's sort of his platform and cracking a lot of A's. You know, identity through this cell phone, um, and we also know that Caleb has a criminal past. So A sort of puts those two together, um, and Caleb is basically being accused of some hacking charges that are false, but it lands him hot water with Rosewood PD. So it gets a little sticky for him. But like I said, he and Hannah sort of work together to figure something out. Hannah talks him into doing something that. Uh, it's pretty, he does not want to do it at all, and I understand why, so it's pretty funny, but it's, it's cool too, but yeah. <laughs>
open up, you know, have maybe kind of change people's perception of them. Who knows? I think that does kind of happen too, a little bit like yeah. you're saying. Yeah. Some sort of action, I think, would be awesome. Yeah. So let's just do a fight. <laughs> let's have like a boxing match. Fly into the to Rosewood, <laughs> drop in from a helicopter. Exactly. <laughs> Machine gun around yeah. you. Around totally. your chest. Rambo. Are there any nuggets that you can kind of tease viewers for upcoming episodes as the season ends? Get ready. Get ready. <laughs> That's, That's a good nugget. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's definitely going to be a roller coaster ride.